Good afternoon, everybody. My name is Dean Trantalis, Mayor of the City of our beautiful Fort Lauderdale, and with me is my colleague on the Commissioner, Commissioner Robert McKenzie. Thank you, Robert, for being here today. Change is coming to Fort Lauderdale as we continue to see it happen day in and day out. And behind me, you'll see progress happening in our beautiful city. Joining us is Representative Carolyn Michaels from the uh, uh, Chamber of Commerce. We have folks from the Florida Department of Transportation. We have uh, Jenny Moore home from the Downtown Development Authority and many people on our staff who have come here to come celebrate and continue to appreciate the change that's happening here in our city. Right behind me, we're seeing the total transformation of the uh, Henry Kinney Tunnel. What's happening here is the reinforcement of the tunnel as well as the extension over the tunnel of 117 feet. In the end, we're going to have a beautiful park, a, a tunnel top park which is going to be a tremendous gathering place for the folks here that come to live and visit and see what Fort Lauderdale is all about. Dan? Sorry. Cut. <laughs> so today, the purpose of today is to announce to the public some of the impact of some of these changes. The purpose of, of today's conference is to talk about the fact that we are going to have to close the tunnel down for one week. The, the tunnel has to be closed completely in both directions and the dates will be between uh, Monday, July 18th through Friday, July 22nd. The purpose of that is to install cross beams that are going to reinforce the, the, the park as well as to reinforce the tunnel project overall. There will be alternative routes that people can take. There will be electronic signs from both directions telling people, requesting people to take alternative routes. Those alternative routes will consist of taking the Andrews Avenue Bridge or the Third Avenue Bridge. Those will be the best ways to get across the river without having to access through the tunnel. The reason why this is important is because if we close it down completely, we can get the job done faster. And that's, and that's the goal here, one week out of our lives to be able to make sure this project is a success. In addition, we will also have to close down Las Olas Boulevard, but that's only going to be for one day, and that day will occur on July 20th. The purpose of that is to be able to complete a project that's going to be part of this total construction and so the construction crews can complete their job and make and ensure that the, the project is is done as soon as possible. So we strongly recommend, we strongly recommend that you go through the Third Avenue Bridge or the Andrews Avenue Bridge in order to get over the river. Please remember, from the 18th of July to the 22nd of July, the tunnel will be closed completely in both directions. If you need more information on this, if you'd like to see the, the direction of the routes, you can go online to fortlauderdale.gov, I'll repeat, fortlauderdale.gov forward slash Kinney Closure. That's K-I-N-N-E-Y Closure. K-I-N-N-E-Y Closure. And there you can get more information. So I'm open to questions. Anyone have any questions? Pretty straightforward. Well, welcome to the new Fort Lauderdale. We're creating a great place and we welcome everybody to come visit and find a place for themselves here as everyone under the sun is welcome. So thank you for being here and uh, we appreciate your getting the message out to the public. Thank you everybody.